have tried uh, the last uh, programming a challenge uh, to finish this uh, verify uh, continuity of the function uh, with this uh, given point. Uh, that is uh, uh, our uh, challenge is to uh, try to uh, review and reevaluate our knowledge uh, for the first three subchapter. Uh, and for this one is uh, the today's one is we implement the gradient descent uh, method. Uh, that is uh, definitely linked to this uh, 7 5, uh, but we've also used the basic quest uh, knowledge we learned uh, for uh, those uh, derivative and uh, approaching to the last is the uh, 7 6 uh, is the global max, max, uh, maximum value found by this uh, gradient ascent method. So we just uh, implement our descent. Uh, but uh, we all, uh, let's uh, see from the challenge here. Uh, so when we uh, analyze uh, this, uh, the gradient, uh, the method, uh, so we implement ascent and compare to the descent, we can see the step of get us uh, closer to is the equation is this one. So uh, we can uh, now understand is uh, the actually is uh, difference is not big. The only difference uh, from the ascent to descent is uh, uh, now is here is the uh, minus sign. So uh, we obtain the value of x new from uh, the x old is, uh, by this uh, the descent uh, way. Uh, but we'll, uh, our challenge definitely if we just change uh, this uh, plus to minus uh, looks like so we get this uh, descent. Uh, through, uh, we can start from this enhanced way, uh, this uh, function uh, we already have on hand. Uh, but beyond that, uh, so uh, in our challenges, uh, we would also like uh, to create a graph of the function and show all the intermediate value it found between uh, finding the minimum. Uh, all the maximum. So uh, also I want to further extend uh, from these challenges. I don't want to uh, keep uh, to uh, the gradient uh, uh, this uh, method. Uh, I may, I think so we can give a user uh, our another choice here is uh, to see I want to find uh, the max, uh, the, uh, the those global maximum or I want to find the global minimum. So we start is uh, we will uh, make this uh, branching and to calculate uh, either is uh, using the gradient uh, the uh, ascent way uh, with the existing function or use this uh, gradient the descent way. So uh, so that is the implement uh, uh, those uh, functions. So let's uh, make our copy first. So we have this one. Uh, let's make that uh, gradient. Generic, let's see, the implement, and uh, this is 9, 2. So we have this one. Uh, and let's see, so uh, we, uh, we will uh, need to receive our function, receive our variable, receive this uh, uh, initial uh, value. And we try this uh, and uh, and the print this. Uh, uh, I think that is all same. So let's do this uh, first. So uh, also uh, the input uh, uh, this uh, uh, choice. I think is input enter the maximum you. Choose global maximum. Oh, we can see is the typing is the max. Oh, maybe we see is that this is the one. Oh, global minimum is two. Then this we uh, we will uh, get that is uh, uh, if choice uh, it's just uh, uh, let's uh, put this as our integer.
then we we kind of uh, this one. So we we only need to va uh, validate uh, the function first. Then this uh, if that is uh, correct function, then we say here. So a choice. equal to one. Well, what we will do, uh, we uh, will do this uh, global maximum. So all these will be uh, same. So else, so let's just uh, do the else. So let's uh, just uh, imagine this, uh, what will be changed. So if that is, uh, I think it's, uh, we should define a minimum global uh, is uh, we call that is the uh, minimum, uh, and uh, we will have this uh, gradient. Uh, so, uh, and then this uh, print here is then is the minimum, and here is the minimum, and this is the minimum. If and then is uh, let's uh, make that is uh, minimum. So var minimum, so that should be the same. Uh, and then the, this uh, doing the calculation here, and we uh, uh, when we come to our gradient, so let's uh, call this as a gradient method now. So, so that is our gradient uh, method for uh, this. Uh, the maximum uh, things. So, uh, and then the uh, let's uh, copy that. So if we have that, we will call that ascent. Now we have this uh, maybe is a descent. And I will copy this to another one. So. Instead of uh, we make our another check is uh, just uh, decent, and uh, let's uh, verify so uh, what we need to do the changes. Uh, this on in the way so we get this uh, x new. So now it should be the negative. So that is one and the while. So this we uh, should have uh, uh, is uh, x old minus x new more than this, I think it's fine. And x old equal to this uh, is fine. So uh, let's try to do our testing. So uh, let's back to our here. So let me see. So using the gradient, we can do the same uh, verification. So we make our function. Here, generic. Here, uh, let's give uh, some variables. That is a maximum. Uh, okay, so let's do our test. The maximum should be still uh, the correct. So, is this one minus thirty times x? Uh, and plus 50x. And we should do the x, 0 0.5. And here, uh, I do the 1 first. So I got this is x, and the maximum is uh, 25. So that is uh, uh, if I got this uh, 0 0.5. So 0 0.5 is here. Uh, but if I go this uh, minus 2, so let's uh, do this. Uh, ensure is I have this copied. So do a second test. So this one keeps same. X, now is I gave this uh, minus 2 and choose maximum. So I got this uh, correct. So let's go to here. So if I make a uh, minimum. So if I put that as a minimum, is uh, here minus uh, maybe uh, minus two got a minimum. Let's uh, see what's happened. So whether is uh, now is can calculate x minus two, and if I now choose two, uh, 
So that is the minus 4 and the 7, this one. So that is not correct. So uh, if is uh, uh, choice is uh, 1, then go to here. If choice is 2, I need to always print a minimum. Uh, but well, what's the, uh, let's see, so it's code grid descent var d uh, var 0 and here is go to here uh, and uh, if this uh, let me see so uh, we should have uh, if not solve this one print this and this x old is the 0 and x uh, old minus a step times this and x old so now it's a minus and the well abs this old minus this make that old equal to new new is ah here so here is also should be the uh, the divided uh, uh, the uh, they, they is, uh, negative so let's uh, run this again so this x minus 2 and 2 so I should get this point at the post oh so negative 0 0.757 and the main uh, negative uh, 25 so let's see the test is around this uh, uh, we can use a positive force so. So x four and the two. So now I get this point. So uh, mathematical way now is we have achieved this uh, uh, function running. So uh, let's now is uh, moving to the plotting. So uh, let's see. So how we can make those uh, plotting? We need to create our range of the number. So uh, we uh, you remember is we use this uh, function range. Uh, this uh, this uh, function defined before so function range is uh, we can have a uh, beginning and end and we define the interval so that is just to try to generate our uh, range of the data so we put this a number is uh, uh, this basic or uh, the empty uh, the set first and well start no more than final then what we will do is the uh, numbers dot append start and start is equal to start plus interval so uh, we will read this uh, interval from our main program uh, and then well, what we will return return these numbers uh, for our plotting purpose usage so we, now we have a list of uh, number with the same interval. Uh, and then the, uh, uh, we should have uh, the numbers of those uh, x and the y's. So uh, within this our calculation part, uh, we should have the, uh, those uh, uh, the numbers uh, uh, with this. Uh, ex uh, uh, we, we should have uh, some uh, those uh, list, uh, the points defined. Uh, so let's uh, back to uh, our uh, the pro uh, the program uh, here. So uh, we should have our uh, also uh, sent uh, this. Not only get our mean, uh, we should define our traverse, uh, and also uh, we will also need another traverse. Then this uh, uh, we should have this uh, sent. Uh, this uh, traversed uh, and with this one uh, then this uh, we create uh, let's say here is uh, else here uh, we will make our plot so create plot with our uh, x traversed is this a list and with our function and the var so x traverse is just uh, from uh, numbers of the uh, list here that uh, is a traverse from our uh, beginning or start to final with the interval and for every x uh, we should calculate uh, f uh, and then with this uh, variable to uh, make this uh, plotting so 
that is our uh, the drivers, and uh, we sent uh, these uh, drivers to uh, the uh, those uh, need is uh, we we also need to get these uh, drivers. So uh, traverses are return the value. Uh, so what is the, this uh, traverse uh, uh, b uh, uh, being? So traverses are just uh, are the empty uh, list. I suppose is then is uh, we will uh, make that uh, keep uh, the ex uh, keep uh, just uh, the append. So when we come to this uh, ascent part, is uh, uh, when we have uh, our e, uh, definition. So before we go to while, uh, let's initial this uh, x uh, drivers. Go to our empty one. Then is a uh, uh, while is uh, uh, more than epsilon. Uh, then as do uh, uh, this uh, new. So the append with this uh, x new. Uh, that's the will be same as uh, we put this uh, insert before this while uh, and also we insert uh, or append our new value then we have a list of the drivers and we need to uh, make that uh, return so return x uh, new uh, and also return the drivers Now we uh, we have these uh, drivers. Uh, let's uh, starting to deal with uh, the over float. So create float. So it's uh, transfer this uh, x drivers f and the var. So we need to use uh, all of these ones uh, to do the uh, floating. Uh, so let's uh, close those uh, other program. Make clean. Uh, and then this uh, we create a function first. So x uh, val uh, value so, uh, is the using this uh, f range. We uh, have done. We need to give this uh, if starting from yeah. Let's not. I think it's uh, for our uh, this function. Uh, we will have our the range so uh, maybe so we have uh, six to six we will use that as the range uh, oh that uh, looks like it's uh, not uh, that is 200 uh, it's a uh, 1200 so let's uh, let that to calculate and we have the uh, f value is the f Up, we should have the first value so with this uh, uh, var replaced by x and we use one line is uh, to four x in x value so then it's uh, we create our f value uh, then we can plot p l t dot plot x value f value and uh, we we just make our uh, maybe our O. So if we want to do that, is uh, definitely we should uh, import uh, the our uh, the floating uh, part is uh, import match deep dot py float as plt. So I think it's so uh, we can now should be able to plot something already. So let's uh, enter. Of, uh, oh, not this one anymore. So x5 minus uh, 30 times x3 plus uh, 50 times x. So we put uh, x4, 2. Let's uh, leave that now. It's calculate and also need to uh, the every. Uh, Unit one is we have over 100 uh, points, so that's a 1200. So let's uh, leave that. Uh, let me post that and to wait. I think it's I have uh, some arrows on here, so I didn't delete the x drivers. Uh, let's uh, stop that. So let's uh, do another part. Uh, just uh, maybe, maybe it's uh, no. x. 
is five miners. Okay, so add subs. So uh, I have some uh, parts. Is uh, do you mean subs? Uh, which line? Uh, F. So I have a uh, one part. Uh, I have an arrow. I think it's on here. So subs. Yeah. Let's uh, try to copy this one. So it looks like it's already approaching to here. That's uh, good. But maybe. Just need to verify x four two. Oh, calculation is done. Oh, I didn't have the. Uh, I didn't do the show right. Finally, it's uh, the PLT show. Let's just try to see what where well, looks like. X four two calculate and show perfect. So even it's not uh, uh, quite nice, but uh, this already draw this one. So it's not so slow. So uh, and what we want to further did is uh, let's back to our challenge. So the also show the all the intermediate value it found before uh, the so uh, that intermediate means uh, we gave a value like four then this uh, they found is uh, uh, four point one seven then this uh, we should highlight from four to four point one seven with uh, those one with a uh, different color so that is the uh, the additional things uh, we should uh, put in here so. Uh, let's uh, uh, go to so, uh, the continue. So uh, we have a plotting that is uh, now is a point traverse. So we use this uh, F traverse to know is uh, how uh, how many points we actual traverse is uh, F subs is use this var x. Or x in this one, so x traverse. Then this uh, scope is not x in x value. So this uh, traverse is uh, what we have uh, done. So then we will have uh, another PLT uh, x traverse traverse f traverse, but with the different uh, uh, the, those uh, points. Uh, and we uh, add our legend. So we plot two, uh, the this uh, curve in one, the this uh, uh, diagram. So uh, that we have this uh, first is the function, and the second line is the intermediate points. So we distinguish them by the different uh, time, uh, different uh, shape best for where it can show. So let's uh, starting from uh, which way. So uh, okay. so using this one. So maybe I use the four. Uh, I can use uh, x and the three. So two and use the two. Yeah, you can see is uh, I starting three and they traverse to uh, this uh, uh, the four. Uh, so let's uh, uh, try to find here. So uh, let me do this uh, difference. And if I also use uh, x and use a three, but now I choose one. So this should travel to here. So you can see travel to our uh, the maximum so value. So that is again is uh, the we discuss. Uh, 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 which value actually you want to uh, actually want to uh, see here, but uh, depending on your initial uh, value, when they come to this uh, approach and gradient uh, here is the already fulfill uh, the criteria, so they will stop here. 
Uh, but if we are putting something is uh, here, maybe let's see the minus uh, 1.9, then I suppose they will travel quite long to here. So let's uh, just so adjust your uh, the initial value that will be uh, very important. So minus uh, 1.9 and using the one. Let's travel. So good is uh, they travel to here, not travel to here. So that is the again uh, depending on your uh, the uh, this uh, the initial value. Uh, so we start is uh, we finish this uh, second uh, the program. Actually, I hope they uh, you can also try to validate my program here because that is uh, a little more beyond uh, this uh, expectation. Uh, we have uh, uh, one program can handle both uh, this ascent and descent. So you can use this uh, just like a gradient function to help you find the maximum and the minimum or, uh, depending on your choice. So uh, that's uh, the second uh, the challenge. Uh, the next challenge we will uh, talk about the area between two curves uh, that uh, will uh, let's uh, back to our mind uh, map. Uh, so if we uh, try to link our uh, knowledge, is uh, is talking about here. So this uh, seven seven is uh, talking about how to uh, use this uh, integral to do the uh, this uh, uh, calculation of the ma uh, the area. Uh, but we uh, we are expanding that with the two curve. So let's see uh, how interesting of this uh, challenge. See you in the next video. Bye.